So we want to praise God for the green that that is flashing tonight. And so I just want to call on Sister Gracie. Are you ready to come and give a word? She's going to give us a word and express how she feels and what's going on in her mind and in her heart and what God has done for her. I've watched her as she's come through this experience. And she is a strong soldier for Jesus. And I want to thank God for what he's done for her and how he has sustained her and how he'll continue to keep her. So she's going to share with us right now. Thank you. Good evening, everybody. First, I want to thank everybody for coming out to support us, um, Junior's Bermuda family. And also, as we're here and everybody's praying and um, praying for my family, I ask that you will keep his family in Jamaica in your prayers. Because we're able to be here, we're able to hear all the news, we're able to be supportive to each other, and they're done. There is nothing that we have up here. So it's just a lot of pain and bitterness. And so I ask that you pray for them. Um, what I want to pretty much say tonight is that um, the main things, um, sorry, the main thing I want to say tonight is whenever these families are facing these tra type of tragedies, first and foremost, I ask people to be supportive. If you don't have nothing nice to say, and don't say nothing at all. Amen. Upliftment is the only thing that gets some people through because you don't know that the slightest things you could have said to them when they go home at night and you're home and you're being asleep and they can't sleep for weeks and days at a time. Also being supportive to other family members um, outside of the immediates that are also going through and also the other families that are going through because a lot of times me being one, you tend to put, deal with your own pain and the own things that you're going through and there are other family, families out there that are going through the same thing and you don't take the time out to support them when you feel strong because this is the only way that we can all get through is when all the families that are going through the same thing have the tools that they know get them through and they go to each other and help each other like Kiana, she was going through her cousin Colford and she called me and just her calling me and reaching out to me somebody that's going through it was such a good feeling inside so and also Rachel made her just us all uplifting and supporting each other and not pointing fingers and not choosing sides and not trying to figure out why and who and none of that. There's families left behind that are in pain. So I ask that you uplift them and that you pray and all the negativity, just push that to the side. Don't even continue to leave it when you hear it. Thank you. 